what is going on gemini my gem crystals it's your girl tiori come to you guys with a message i want to spill want you to know if you're new to the channel welcome i appreciate you all for your love and support if you haven't already make sure you like this motherfucker you comment on this motherfucker gemini you subscribe to this motherfucker and you ding ding dong ding 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 dong bitch ass ding ding dong you ding 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 dong you ain't that bad head ass okay read on ding it flip switch the rose take the residency it does not out all signs energies and gender roles are full and terror so just keep that in mind you and i all right also if you would like to book with me on one of my um readings sorry for the special going on <laughs> I'm all over the place. You guys can check the description box below for more information on that. I don't pull the cards. I just read them. So if this isn't your message, you can always check your Venus rising or your moon signs to get more clarity because it may or may not be your message. Uh, your overall message, because yeah, you in, I think, Taurus, my tornadoes, you guys are the only two that Spirit gave me messages for. Yours was weak connections, some new Wi-Fi, raising the bar. Okay. We guys connections, some new Wi-Fi, raising the bar. So when I was trying to do a reading, and it's still probably fucked up, the connection keeps fucking up. I feel like you're in connections that are very weak, or you're realizing that you've been in weak ass connections, connections where people aren't raising the bar, where things aren't consistent, where things are <laughs> blurry, and it's always seeming like you lose, you lose interest, or you lose connection you lose sight of the future goals all right it could feel like something or someone's holding you back but whatever this is i feel like you're in weak ass connections and this is some weak ass wi-fi all right and we need some new wi-fi in this bitch we need some new <laughs> we need some new energy so we gotta raise the bar all right so help me raise the bar gemini for gemini it says i know my soul is truly beautiful all right so this is all about your soul, the Akashic Records, so memories, understanding how beautiful you are, especially how beautiful you've been, everything and anything it took you to get to where you're at. Inhale and exhale. You could be doing like a Libra or a um, Saggy. Yeah, I think Saggy had that. So whatever this is, was it Saggy? Yeah. I feel like somebody could be pissing you off, and if or this could already be what happened, but you're getting in an energy where you're breathing, you're breathing more, inhaling <laughs> the good shit, exhaling the bullshit. You're learning how to let go. Uh, this is a solution for you. You're gonna realize this helps you a lot. Just breathing, because you're an air sign, just like I told Libra. It's necessary for. It's necessary. What the fuck? So shit is just moving in this bitch, Gemini. Shit. Okay. So you guys can be going through some um, <laughs> paranormal activity in this bitch. Somebody could be experiencing paranormal activity. All right, don't get scared though. That was that was weird though. Ain't nothing over there for shit to just move. I ain't fucking nothing over there. That's the closet. So I feel like the point of the matter is just know that <laughs> your soul is truly beautiful. As long as you know that, it don't matter what nobody else think. I got these new cards. They're my census cards I made. And they're helping me um, help you guys regulate the senses that you could be going through when it comes down to this situation. All right? Yeah. So decayed smells. Uh oh, this is all about your smelling, your, what you're smelling. So something stinks. It smells, something smells like death or somebody could have passed away here. You could go to a funeral. Um, or something something smells like fetus or decayed is like all right stinky stinky but right so i feel like something stinks so something could stink but as long as you know that your soul is truly beautiful it's okay it's time to raise the bar though i'm getting heavy the wi-fi stinks it's horrible it's horrible all right so yeah i feel like there's an energy of you thinking you're you're breathing meditating and you're having new ideas that come to you that solve so many of your problems. Um, they're they're gonna help you just learn more and stay inspired. All right, this could literally be meditation. I'm getting like a yogi energy. Some of you guys could be like those type of energies where you like to just meditate and chill like that. But this is good. 
something your house could be dirty as well gemini make sure you clean your house or take out the trash because there could be a lot of trash or you could have pets or animals um just take care of yourself but something stinks so you guys been on the scorpio they had decayed yeah all right for gemini for gemini what's your advice All right, believe in yourself. This is all about your own your own thoughts of yourself. So think positive. You're gonna start thinking more positive. All right, you could on the Leo. You're gonna start to have more motivation. This is what you need to do. They want you to. The spirit wants you to believe in yourself. Know that your soul is beautiful. Know that um, the memories that you've made are beautiful. Even though there may be some shitty people you made with or shitty places you made them in. <laughs> shitty 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 i don't know but i just feel like know that you did the best you could for a lot of you and if you didn't know that know that you all you gotta do is be yourself you don't have to try to fake the funk or anything okay so that people don't see you for who you are believe in yourself be yourself and the rest is yet to come so i feel like you're realizing something's been long overdue all right you having these thoughts these reflections it's time you're realizing where you need to go who you need to be how you need to get there yeah you're awakening you're having a new perspective on things okay could be done with the pisces scorpio cancer and there's a lot of things that are hidden a lot of things that may have been confusing but you're getting out of this yep there you go you're getting answers to your questions i feel like you know all right, so for Gemini, there it goes. There's a secret already on that fuck shit. Could be with the cancer. All right, so something's all an illusion. You're gonna get clarity on this illusion or this secret. You could also be having a dream. Could be with the Pisces. All right, so all of a sudden you get clarity on a secret. All of a sudden you're obsessed or you're you're unexpectedly obsessed with something or someone. All right, could be with the Capricorn, uh, Pisces. Um, Scorpio Aquarius All right, but something here is only it's something here is only something it's like a secret that you can only get from your intuition or from um, dreams or from um, like intuitive people pre high priestesses or people who are knowledgeable in that way this could have to do with your family you could be supporting your family or giving your family a this is what your family's doing for you but i feel like somebody could be a secret somebody secretly gives their family attention could with the leo virgo uh saggy and some you're in confirmation at the aries leo sag this king of wands they they lied about um trying to turn the tables on somebody and it was a collaboration they were working with somebody to turn the tables they didn't work with a tourist libra or a mother or a baby mother or a spouse or a yeah, heavy Taurus. I'm getting somebody's spouse. They've been working together to turn tables on you because um, you support your family or you secretively support your family. Well, I feel like you're, you and your family are turning tables on them. The fuck? What? That's crazy. <laughs> That's the secret. That's the justice. So that's a blessing. Because somebody's a liar, 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 all right, or somebody has secret desires, could be with the Pisces, Virgo, Aquarius, or Gemini. But I feel like you want to be single, or you want to do something on your own, or you want to talk to someone, or you want to go somewhere, or you, you. And I feel like somebody's telling you no, or you're telling somebody no, could be with the Aquarius, or Gemini. All right, so I feel like you don't, you don't like that. <laughs> that somebody's been trying to like argue with you or make you feel conflicted or push you away or keep you out of something yeah, that's what it is you don't like that somebody's been trying to keep you out of some sort of information because they don't like that uh they don't like what you desire i feel like you have the secret desires 
Gemini, and somebody doesn't like them, so they've been trying to keep you out of their secret desires. Their, but I feel like your secret desire is like it has to do with um your family or something. Or you want peace or you want something. I feel like there, there's a secret desire, a secret. There's a person who makes you very happy. All right, that you you like to give attention to or get attention from but it's like a secret desire like there's nothing wrong with it it's just like i feel like you feel like you can't tell people that you're invested into this or you feel like something here could have to do with people's culture background race creed uh religion morals values sexual orientation i don't know it's like what some, there's a reason why somebody can't tell people why they do something all right but it, it's how they do it in the new beginning, okay? Because of the Aries. So I see you giving someone a lot of attention, or somebody's giving you a lot of attention. All right, something got to do with a husband, a father, a spouse, or a boss, the emperor, the emperor. But it's the emperor going on a new beginning. So somebody's giving somebody a lot of attention secretively. This could be, like I said, somebody's spouse, father, husband. But they're not, um, for some of you, yeah. This isn't so somebody's um jealous because of this. I don't know how to explain it. But this is your family, so I don't know. This is somebody who's a soul tribe member, somebody who's like your family, or somebody who knows your family, or somebody who will bring justice. So I feel like people have been lying to the law, working with the law against you or against you and someone that you care about and love. Or this is you know, you doing this, but you could go the tours. I feel like somebody's getting left out in the cold because of this and they're mad about this. They could be also going to jail or having to fight the justice system because they lied to the law and lied dealing with the law here. Coming on to Taurus. So somebody's mama, a baby mom, or spouse, or a fiance, or some a bitch, a bitch, a bitch. <laughs> right? A bitch who's ungrateful, a bitch who's a hater, a bitch could be going with the cancer. Yeah, so I see somebody admiring somebody, but they're at a crossroads, or this is you. So somebody gives you attention secretively um, because they desire a new beginning with you, or this is you in some way, shape, or form. But or this is somebody you're dealing with, but they don't know how to speak on it. They don't know how to make a choice. They're going to have to make a choice because somebody won't stop. You put on the Aquarius, Gemini, somebody won't stop. Like, yeah, I feel like somebody could be religious and somebody is spiritual and more so like your family could be spiritual you could have a spiritual family member or somebody that you know somebody's family definitely has high priestesses like someone who's not religious at all there's somebody who's more like just intuitive okay <laughs> they're a free thinker and they're very smart they have a lot of information and they get a lot of downloads and memories and dreams of the past but somebody's upset because of this because somebody this high priestess energy or this is you remembers the past lives or the past dealing with it, your past or the past lives dealing with somebody else that you're connected to coming with the scorpio pisces yeah they're the solution to all somebody's problems or answers this is you this is your energy could with the wheel but somebody that you're connected to or you're connected to is connected to this person or this is you and there's a gemini who's been holding a grudge um or who's going to be somebody's going to be holding a grudge against a Leo because um, because they, they want justice for a high priestess. And they're gonna be holding a grudge against a lot of people. I feel like somebody here is upset, could with the uh, Gemini Capricorn, because they were confused about um, some sort of commitment dealing with a Taurus and a Sagittarius to betray uh, someone that they love, who they were actually holding back from. They were holding back their love from this person or holding back their or this is you, so Gemini, you were, you were holding back your love or something from somebody who is spiritual in your family or in your tribe, or you were holding back something, your energy. Some of you guys, people were holding grudges, but I feel like people were holding back. They weren't saying anything or giving to someone because they felt like um, they were worried about their family. It was like somebody felt like they had to choose between their family, their immediate family or something, or their religious family or their, that type of shit, or the high priestess. And it's like, damn, if it's that serious, then fuck i don't know so somebody didn't know who to choose but then it got to a point where people started to betray this high priestess because somebody didn't know what to choose so this could be you and somebody or this 
you know, they're doing a little bit of somebody started to feel attacked. They started to really read between the lines, get dreams, messages, and remember things. And they started to protect themselves more and others. And this is causing somebody to not be happy, okay? Because they don't want to go to jail or they're afraid. Like, this is this never made somebody happy, is what I'm trying to say. <sighs> okay. Someone listening to a high priestess, having a family member that's high priestess or something like that, never made somebody happy, ever. No lifetime ever will. But somebody was abusing. Somebody didn't know that because someone didn't like someone, that they were holding a grudge and being hateful and vengeful towards them, all because they didn't want to see somebody get away because they knew somebody thinking about a new beginning or this is you. You've been thinking about a new beginning. You've been thinking about a high priestess. Or you've been thinking about following your intuition to go somewhere could be with the Pisces Leo and you know something that you're just you're not speaking on and you're doing things that you don't feel like you speak on because you you feel bad for it yeah you feel guilty you're not that's the secret yeah you're not somebody could like a high priestess if you don't the cancer that could be a cancer who's interested in someone But I feel like you're blocking a Leo or something during a competition though. Somebody had a child, put on the Virgo. There's a baby that was born in your family and um or a Capricorn's family in the past. And this child's been trapped or stuck. Put on the Virgo. They disappeared or somebody went missing, but it was a collaboration and betray. Um, somebody here dealing with somebody could lose their job, um, dealing with the Capricorn Virgo Taurus, so that somebody can lose. So I feel like there's secrets on this person that you you're giving attention to. Um, I feel like somebody's worried. Kudos to Virgo. Yeah, so somebody's worried that you're finding this Capricorn Virgo Taurus's work, or you're listening to somebody or you're discovering somebody here, or you're discovering more information on this Queen of Pentacles in their past. Some got to do with somebody's mama. Somebody's mama could have disappeared or went missing, could have been with the Taurus Libra in the past, Scorpio, Virgo. But you're in confirmation. There's a couple of Virgo Taurus who, who got confirmation in the past of the disappearance. Um, and I feel like someone don't trust a Taurus or someone don't trust somebody no more like whoever somebody uh, somebody got receipts on a mama or something on the past I feel like somebody got receipts though and their work is bringing people confirmation and clarity so I feel like somebody's like a they, they discover the truth or they they discover deep secrets and <laughs> But they bring, they make people's dreams come true. Somebody hears like a dream come true, or they make, they solve all your problems, or they're just something that's beautiful, and they they believe in themselves, and they they inspire others to do it. But somebody don't like that. Somebody helps you do this. Or you give this type of person attention, or you you did in the past, um, because they've been trying to turn tables on you. They've been doing illegal ass activity. They've been causing you to lose. You know, with the Scorpio, all right. We don't the cancer. So the tables are going to turn. You're going to be guided to see the four cups, six of swords, that somebody was no longer, no, no, um, not really invested into something. It was like they were trying to keep you away from something, but they weren't even invested into what they were trying to keep you invested in. So if this is a family, somebody wasn't really invested into the family, or somebody wasn't really invested into a job, or into their religion, or into their love life, or into whatever the fuck this is. All right. They were interested in watching somebody else move on. So now somebody here is getting more information on what somebody's been doing. All right. On a Taurus or an Aquarius. And they have good intentions. Or this is you. You have good intentions. But you're, you're doing this because you want more information and you know somebody don't lie to you. Why would they? All right. So I see there's justice for Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Queen of Cups. And their baby, somebody had a baby in the past. All right, could be with the Libra, but there was an Aries energy, a father that lied, dealing with uh, dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Somebody lied about somebody and their baby. 
they lied about leaving to go to this cancer crisis Scorpio. It's an Aries, Gemini, or a, um, yeah, heavy an Aries, Gemini. They they uh, lied about going to see somebody. Mm -hmm. But the Aries wasn't really interested in someone. So the Aries, there's an Aries who lied about going to see a, a cancer crisis Scorpio. I feel like um, this person's going to jail for that or something. Or, but this was in the past. Yeah, well, somebody's getting clarity and closure on all that. You guys are going to be okay. What's the fool? So this is good. I see you admiring somebody and it's helping you get more information on a tourist or on a commitment or on a job or on something you may a marriage. You're getting clarity. You're going to be guided to the truth. All right. Somebody could be moving, which th there's a tourist having a conversation or somebody's at, somebody's having a conversation with somebody's family or something to do with a family. But this is like people that are, um, yeah. Okay, so there's a Cancer Pisces Scorpio, Aquarius being guided to Virgo. Somebody's being guided to tell the truth. Somebody's telling the truth, having to do with a tourist or a job, or a, somebody's having to snitch, or mm -hmm, they have to snitch about something. What's the fool? But I feel like somebody wants to be with somebody in your family. Okay. All right. A new beginning. So somebody's moving. Could be done with the tourist. You're getting more information that a tourist, they have a new love interest dealing with a cancer or something. Or, Somebody's getting married or in a commitment or, in, or they're doing something big or this is you. There's a cancer though on a Taurus, heavy. Somebody who's already married is going through another relationship. Coming up in Aquarius? I don't know. What the fuck is this? Yeah, somebody's like... So somebody's cheating for some reason. Um... Yeah, somebody got a house and everything. So I see somebody going through separations or divorces or counseling and all type of shit because they were majorly betrayed. Somebody can never trust somebody again. Things are going to backfire. There's going to be a loss. All right. One more and then we're done. We're done. All right. So, yeah, somebody here um, is someone you that uh, you didn't know about. So I feel like you're watching one thing go down, having to do with your family or something, but then behind your back or something, there's like elite people in law that work with, with law or people that are part of the justice system, military, you could know, with the Libra, Cancer, um, Aries, somebody's father or husband or whatever, baby daddy. The Emperor, I feel like they're working law. They're lying about a Cancer Party Scorpio um, leaving or, or about them leaving to go to a Cancer Party Scorpio. But it's because in the past they were dating someone and they also been lying about moving in with a Taurus. They live with a Taurus, a Cancer, heavy. Somebody's already in a commitment or they just got married in the past, but whatever it is, people been lying about dating people in the past in uh, behind your back. But this is you. Kudo with the Capricorn, Leo, Gemini, Aquarius, Aries, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah. Somebody also lied about abusing someone, attacking someone. There's a loss here. Yeah. And somebody lost a love interest and a new opportunity in the past because someone lied about who they were dating in the past. And to this day, they still be fucking on this person on and off, on and off, on and off. Somebody lost their mom or some shit, all type of shit. They, they did. They child, all that. I see you all the peaceful light on your journey. Until next time.